Hi and welcome, I'm Paul. And I'm Marie. And we are a UK reselling couple based in Hampshire. And this is the Turning 10 Old Toys into £2,000 Challenge. Challenge update time. It's week 28, hun. It's week 28. 28. Where's that time gone? Whoosh. Fast approaching Christmas now, hun. Woo. We are not far away now. Santa's on his way. He is. So should we take you through where we are this week in this very exciting episode of week 28 of the challenge. The challenge. So yes. 10 toys. We are a couple and we have a lovely daughter who will be 21 years old. 21 years old, hun, next year. How old does that make us feel? Yeah. Oh, so what we're trying to do is take 10 of her toys that she no longer wanted from her childhood and we thought, well, resellers, we can turn that into money. We'll surprise her with a big £2,000 for her 21st birthday. Hmm. Whew, it's a bit, a bit of an ask, wasn't it's, it? Um, bit it of is an ask. a bit of an ask. It's, it's a bit of a challenge. Well, that's the whole point of it. It is, yeah. <laughs> and so far we've sold six of those toys. Four just do not want to sell, do they? No. So we've sold six, no. and with the money from those six, we've taken off the eBay fees, we've taken off the postage, and we've used the, the raw profit, and we've invested it into only clothing and shoes, because that's the challenge to us, to learn about clothing and shoes. And so far, with that money, we have bought 170 items, we have sold 57 items, we have 112 items currently on or due to be listed on eBay. What's the kitty, hun? What kitty do we have? What have we built up? 135.75 so far. And those 112 items, hun, have a listing value of? £2,614.96. If only we could sell them, hun. I know, we, we just need to sell them. We could give up then, couldn't we? Yeah. Challenge done. Well, that's the listing value then, isn't it? Yeah, they've not sold yet no, and the profit. And so this is where we are at week 28. So we've been out buying. We go out one morning a week, only one morning, which is mm. why we can never really spend that kitty, can we? We never no. get the the quality of merchandise that we need. Mm. But we have bought some things, hun. Let's show These them what here. we've got. Now, I just want to give a shout out to Leanne Hill and um, Nespresso, I think it was, who um, both commented on the fact that we should be giving oh, yeah. the sizes <laughs> of the clothing in case anyone's interested. Why yeah. didn't we think of that, hun? I know, I know. You do these things, we don't you? We just try and get through the challenge. We don't think about the um, giving all the information. No, <laughs> Give us what it. the sizes are. That's what yeah, we can do. Yeah, for 27 guess. weeks. <laughs> <laughs> so I've written all the sizes down this time. Look at us being organised. So we're going to start with, hun, this Roman Originals dress, size 14, which we paid £3 for. Isn't that a lovely colour? It's sort of look, got a, a, like a linen look to it, isn't it? Yeah. Not yeah, going to be that popular this side of Christmas, but the spring will soon be upon us. Um, and we're going to put that up for £18.99, hun, and see how we get on. Obviously, if anyone does see, see anything in these videos that they have their eye on, please contact us on Instagram. Instagram or Facebook. I mean, Instagram's yeah. probably the best place, isn't it? Yeah, because we're um, always but... open to mates' rates. So contact <laughs> us first before buying anything. Yes, yeah, no, it's, Instagram is the same name as, as the channel, so yeah. it's Den UK. So. We're not good at this promotional lark, we? We don't hun? do, it's we not don't really do us, is it? It's not us. <laughs> so now we're going to move on to a warehouse dress. This, is, this was £3. It's a size 8, if any of you are lucky enough to be a size 8. It's gorgeous. It is lovely, isn't it? Um, and we are putting up for eighteen ninety nine, hun. Quite autumnal colours as well. Mm. Lovely that. This one's one of my favourites, hun. Oh, I made a right hash of that. This one. is a lovely um, kaleidoscope dress, sort of Ooh. a cruise shipy type. This is quite. If a anyone's long one. lucky enough to go. Let me um, um, just show you the top part it's first. Lovely. Sort of a bit sequiny. Yeah. Got like a taupe colour underneath it, very yeah, gorgeous. It just flows lovely, doesn't this it? This is a yeah. size 14, Can't still not my size, hun. Huh? I'm not having any luck here with these clothes. It was £3 and we're putting up for £18.99, but it's lovely, isn't it? Really it's very nice. nice. Yeah. Yeah. Definitely cruise shippy, somewhere yes. posh. Then we're going to move on to this phase 8 dress. Now we paid up for this, we paid £9.99, which is a lot of money for us in a charity shop we don't, and clothing. Yeah. It we is. were very brave, weren't we? It is lovely though, it's very, very nice. It is size 10, so it's quite a slender size, but it's very gorgeous, isn't it, hun? It's very gorgeous, yeah. <laughs> Stands out, that dress. Um, it was 9 99 and we're going to put it up for 39 99 Sort of like a bodycon dress, zips up the side, very yeah. nice. 
I must admit, I did sort of buy it thinking we could perhaps sell it as, in, during party season, but I don't think it's going to, with all I the, the, the strikes and everything, issues, I think it's going to... Yeah, I don't, yeah, I don't, I don't think, think it's going to going to go is but it but it will go at some point cause it yeah, is hopefully lovely. I'll get it on before Christmas but I don't think it's going to be have any chance yeah um, so then we're going to move on to this Jane Norman dress now this is a size 10 again lots of slender people donating this year in the I charity know, shops I <laughs> um, this was 7 99 so we paid a bit more for this as well but look at it so gorgeous um, again I've bought, bought it for party season which is just about to end um, <laughs> but you never know some people do, do get to go on holiday and have fun um, have lovely sort of party seasons in different times of the year. Yes. So that's going to go up for £39.99, hun. Look at me being greedy. So then we've got a blue vanilla dress, hun. This was new with tags. So I thought we'd give it a go. It's a size 12 and it was £3. I think we're going to try it up for £16.99, hun. Give it a go. It's quite thin though, isn't it? It is very thin. So it's definitely more of a summery. I would have thought so, yes. Type. Yeah, yeah. Then you've got this gorgeous orange, you get noticed in this hun, this is oh, a River yes. Island dress. It is a size, oh, I have to put my glasses so on for at, this so one hun. Oh, I've put a question mark, there's no size. Oh, okay. Which is always difficult when you're looking at anything in the charity shop, check out the size first. Don't just buy it willy nilly like we have because oh, is that what we're then you have a hell of a oh, well, job trying okay. to figure out what the size is. We'll see. Um, what I normally do is um, get someone like Emily to perhaps Try it on Try and get, on get and a see. rough idea. I always me I'll measure it yeah. and sort of give the measurements, but it's m much more difficult to sell if there's no if there's no yeah, mix, that's um, it. size. I mean, it is, it, again, it is lovely. Yeah, yeah, it's a shame about the size. Yeah, so we'll have to get Emily to try it on and, yeah. and try and you know, work it out. But that was three pound, and we were putting up for eighteen ninety nine. So then, hum, we're moving on to some Hobbs trousers. These are nice, aren't they? Mm. They are size fourteen. They were two pound. And we are Sorry. going to put them up for £19.99. They're sort of a linen, I'll have to look. I haven't looked to see what they're made of, but they look like linen to me. Yeah, yeah. So we will see. Yeah. But thank you, hun. You've done a great job of displaying yeah, all those my there. my arms are killing me again. And we've spent £35.48p <laughs> there, hun. Right. So, breaking news. This is going to be quick. Yeah. <laughs> it's Not always much. Christmas. People aren't really buying... Um, a lot of the clothing we have at the moment. Yeah. Um, so, but we have sold this gorgeous um, Bowden ladies blouse. Now, at the time, I did I did pay handsomely for this mm. because we paid five pound. But I knew it was gorgeous. Yeah. Um, I was a bit gutted it wasn't my size, but there you go. It did go, I think, on offer at fifteen pound. Um, we've taken off the fees and the postage, so £9.59 is going back into our kitty hun. Yeah. So we started out this video at £135.75p. We have spent £35.48 on those lovely clothes we've just yeah. shown you. That brought us down to £100.27p. We just added £9.59 to the kitty. What's our new kitty hun? Our new kitty is £109.86. So as it stands at this point in the video, we have bought for this challenge 178 <laughs> items. We've sold 58 items and we ha currently have 128, 120 items. 120, yeah. For this challenge and the um, listing value is this much, our new Two, listing value. £2,790.88. So that's where we're at at, at this the moment, moment in the, time. Yeah. Now we're going to move on to Miss A. Now Miss A is a lovely lady who sent us a box of 30, 30 high-end branded items. Mm. Um, and over time, um, we've been doing the same style of thing. And this is this is going to be for Emily's um, spending, spending money. money. I don't two think, separate challenges. I don't think you mentioned the first challenge is to give Emily a two-week holiday. That's, That's what right, the whole yeah. two thousand pound <laughs> is about. Sort of forgot to mention that at the beginning. So sorry about that. So this is the spending money to go with Emily's amazing holiday. Getting a little bit jealous now of Emily's holiday because um, I could do with a holiday after all this challenge. It's yeah. it's worn me out. But anyway, back to Miss A. 30 items we've been buying and selling and so far we have bought with the money from those some of those items that have sold 213 items we've sold 87 items we have 207 items listed or due to be listed on ebay what's the kitty hum 278 pounds and 25 pence and of those 207 items hum what's the listing value 3540 and 14 pence i know so we've just got to sell them now haven't we that's the that is the challenge there's, there's a the lot of money's worth there yeah so yeah <coughs> excuse me 
<coughs> have slowed down at the minute because of Christmas, but um, well, we're assuming so. I mean, the postage uh, situation has not is, helped. It's not, it's really so, not um, helped this year. But you know, is what it is, is isn't what it? it? Is. You have to deal with it. But we've been out buying because um, that's what we do every week. So let's show you. Let me whiz these across. Oh, yeah. there you go, my love. Thank you. And we are going to start with this gorgeous next dress. It was three pound. It's a size fourteen, and we'll be putting up for eighteen ninety nine. You know what? Is that the? That's the back. That's the back. Yeah. That's the front. <laughs> It's nice though, hun, isn't it? You should model these. You should do it. <laughs> oh, I don't know, my love. That nice yes, autumnal colours, nice cuffs. Mm. Now this next one, hun, is going to be a bit of a challenge. This two-parter. Two this next one. It's a dress. It's oh. a Wallace oh, feels dress. Nice. And I've called it a bolero. Bolero? 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 No, I don't know, hun. <laughs> I've made, made a bit of a fool of myself there, I think. It is lovely. But let's tackle yeah. the dress. It's a mm. lovely, heavily beaded dress. Mm. Now, there are some areas on it, hun, where the beadings are not there. Well, you, you're you don't really expect notice that, though, it. Aren't you? Yeah, because um, of the make of it. Yeah. But it's, it's very heavily beaded. Mm. It is a size. Now. It is a two different sizes, this. This is a size 10. The bit that covers your bingo wings is a size 10. Yeah. The dress is a size 14. Because obviously some people have bigger hips than they do bigger shoulders, don't they? So, okay. um, so it's a two part matching set, very gorgeous. So somebody, okay, but is that how it would have been sold? I think, yeah, when you, yeah, you can, it's normally like a matching set, so you can buy okay. a different size um, because you, they might be quite petite on the top and a little bit, so, you know, so, they would, on the, so these would have been hips. sold separately originally? I would have thought so. I would right. have thought oh, okay. not everyone wants to have this. If you're like a younger lady, yeah. you might not need this to cover your bingo wings. So <laughs> so the two together were only £3. And look at all that beading. I mean, it would oh, have been no. a fortune new. Yeah. Um, the top is 10, size 10. The dress is size 14. And we'll be putting the two up for £24.99. Hun. Selling them as a pair and seeing how we well, get on. Yeah. Yeah. Again, cruise ship sort of thing. Yeah. This is a new brand to us, Hun. This is, it is. I want to say Geo. Yeah. Don't know if I'm getting that right, Hun. It's a, a jacket, a gorgeous sort of pink, like a neon pink, isn't it, my love? Yeah. Um, this is three pounds and it's large. I don't I don't like it when it says that because it's yeah. it's some people's large is not the same as another people's large, so it's always a bit difficult, but it says large, so I'll measure it and put the details down. Um, we paid three pounds and I put up nineteen ninety-nine. Nice, isn't it? It's lovely. This one, hun, is a next dress. This was £3 and it's a size 12. It's gorgeous, isn't it? I like this detailing here. Very nice. We'll be putting that up for £18.99. It's quite nice because you can use that for the office or put something fancy with it and have it as a party dress. Yeah. Two uses there. This one's nice, hun. This is a phase 8. I'm loving the phase 8 dresses. Um, lovely isn't it it's lovely sort of navy blue color it's a size 10 we paid 8.99 so we did pay more than we normally would but it's because we thought we could probably get a bit more money for it um so we're going to put it up for 39.99 now if you've watched these videos normally when we mention phase eight we do mention tam and tam and bell, don't tam we? bell we do yes and we just want to give a special shout out to the lovely cole who fell over and um Spent oh, yesterday in a hospital, bless him. Did, yeah, Broke his arm. Um, so just, you know, if Tam and Bella are watching, we, we really do feel for you. Emily had a, an incident a while back, a few years oh, ago. Quite a long time ago. Where she <laughs> spent um, some time in hospital, and it's such a worrying time. It is, so, yeah. Um, we want to send um, all our best wishes to you and to Cole, and to hope that Tam um, hope you recovers well. Yeah, and, I mean, uh, to be honest, when you're a lad and you've got a broken arm, you're a bit of a legend at school, aren't you? I mean, Emily, <laughs> right, when yeah. she broke her arm, she... She uh, got preferential treatment. She could yep. use the, the whiteboard and everything. She loved it. <laughs> <laughs> but must have been horrific at the time. So we're yeah. sending our love. So let's move on to this. This is a John Lewis dress, hun. This is new with tags. What a bonus. Now, it just says medium. Again, hun, why don't they just give a size? Um, it's quite roomy, though. So um, it I think is. that's it the looks quite... design of oh, it. Hang on, I'm holding the wrong bits here. What's that? That's a, that's a tie, I think, that goes around the sort of neck. <laughs> <laughs> that's it. It's right. like a short sleeve. It's sort of like a smock sort of type of right. dress. There we go. Very nice, it. though. It does seem... And I think it's got something like £80 pound on it. But someone's written all over the label, so I'll oh. have to have a look at that. 
but it's a medium. We paid £6.49 and we are going to put it up for £29.99, hun. Give it a go. Lovely. That's all you can do, isn't it? Can you pop that one over there? I can, my love, yeah. Thank you. Oh, oh, dump it down there. This is a caramelin dress, hun. This was £6.99 and it's a size 10. Lovely colour, isn't it? Mm. This is going to go up for £39.99. Not sure if we'll get anywhere near that, but you've got to give it a go. You do? That's it. And then we've got this. I did try and sell this to Emily, but she wasn't. She wasn't. <laughs> oh, it's quite long. This, this is very it? long. This is made by ASOS. Now, we don't normally buy ASOS, but when no. I've been looking um, at prices, sometimes you can get good money for ASOS, especially if it's a bit unusual. Now, I quite like the look of this, hun, but what I didn't realise is one of the buttons is missing. Oh. So that's, um, I'm going to either have to replace all the buttons. So that's why I tried to get Emily to have it, but she... <laughs> she wasn't having any of it. She didn't want it. So it's a um, ASOS, pair of ASOS dungarees. Um, it's more sort of summer wear, isn't it? But they're very long. That's the reason she didn't want long. it. Um, I'm guessing you roll them up or you've yeah, got to be really be. tall to wear them. They were 5 .99. They are a size 14 and we'll be putting them up for 24 99 to be our first sort of go at ASOS and see how yeah. we get on. But yeah. um, that sort of concludes what we've spent this week, hun. £40 and 46p. So we started the video um, with a kitty of £278 and 25p. We've just spent £40 and 46p, so that takes our kitty down to £237 and 79p. Mm. Breaking news, hun, again, a short one. A short this one. is the yeah. Chow Collection silk shirt that we picked up a few weeks ago for three pound. Hmm. We have sold it for fifteen ninety nine on an offer. It was either offer or sale. I think um, probably an offer. We've taken off the um, fees and the postage and the profit that's going back into the kitty, which includes that initial outlay, is twelve pounds and twelve p. So why don't you give us the new? Kitty the reveal, new kitty huh? is two hundred and forty-nine pounds and ninety-one pence. So, as it stands at this point in the video, we have bought two hundred and twenty-one items. We have sold eighty-eight items. We currently have two hundred and fourteen items either on or due to be listed on eBay. Hmm. So, the kitty, as Paul just said, was two hundred forty-nine ninety-one. Look at us saying in unison. Oh, no. <laughs> Go on, then you do the big kitty reveal, it's big listing reveal. Three thousand seven hundred and forty-two pounds and seven pence. Just getting there, huh? Isn't it? Well, it's you know, for week twenty eight, we got a lot of value in all these all these clothes now that are listed. Yes. So it's, just, it's just really, um, yeah, like so getting them. around. I think turn, the skill, around the skill is going to be trying to sell them yeah. before her birthday in yeah. June. That's I think we'll be, be kicking it up into major high gear. Yes. Sort of beginning I don't next quite know year, how we're going to do that, but no, we are no, going to have to do something <laughs> because otherwise we, you know, we desperately want to make our target. Yes. And if we we're doing it for a whole year, we don't want to fail because we're going to look like wallies. <laughs> so we're going to have to have a discussion over Christmas as to how we're going to steer things forward to, to, yes. to try and get that money. Yeah, yeah. Now, part of our challenge to ourselves is that we learn about clothing so that we know what to pick up. And this mm. week, I'm going to put my glasses on because we're getting serious now, hun. This yeah. week, we have gone for the same person that we shouted out last week, and that is the lovely... Andrew Collier. Now, the reason for this is that he gave us a list um, on the previous one mm. of, of names, and I didn't. I did one last week, and I thought I can't just leave it at that because the, you know it's sometimes difficult to find the names. And he's give, kindly given us the names, so we thought we'd give him a shout out again and go through two other names from his list. So thanks ever so much, Andrew. Very kind of you. So we're going to start with album. Album, album, A L B A M. I want to say album, album. like you know, like no. record album, album. but I yeah, think it's album, album. album. Um, was founded by James Shaw and Alistair Ray in 2006. Modern crafted clothing is what album, album stands for, <laughs> and all of their clothing is made in England. That's rare, isn't it? Mm. All made in England. Oh, fantastic. Now, we always look at, at sold because we have a bit of a model here where we want to have a rough idea. Can we go into a charity shop? Can we spend £5 and then get 20, you know, something that sells for £20 and over? That's our sort of quick way of trying to get an idea of profit, isn't it? Yeah. We don't want to be messing around with one and two pounds. We want no. to be we want, yeah. spending a decent well, amount getting a decent amount back. That's it. So on the... Um, Let's have a look here. I've, I've looked at some items that have sold and I think it was the 11th that I looked at and 15, um, no, sorry, 21, reading the wrong bit, yes. 21 pre-owned items um, have sold on eBay. 
11 of those sold for over £20 and three of those sold for over £40. So quite good money attached to this brand, hun. Hmm. So let's take you through. We have a utility jacket, number one, utility jacket that's sold on auction for £30 with £6.85p postage. So that's not bad, is it? Hmm. Then we're going to go for an XXL floral print men's shirt. So just the shirt went for £35 plus nice. £2.94. So quite a strong brand to look out for, quite good money. Even a pair of jeans, hun. Blue jeans here. They've got, it's a 34 waist and they went for £40 plus £3.35p. Wow, yeah. So we'll definitely be keeping an, an eye out for this brand. Yeah. We have a moleskin work jacket. We've only ever had moleskin trousers, haven't we? We've never mm. had a work jacket. But this went for £40 plus £6.45. So yeah, definitely good money there. And then we're going to finish, hum with a cracker. of It's an orange Sherpa chunky fleece that went for £67 for a fleece. Wow. On auction, had three bids and £3.90 postage. So it just gives you a rough idea. Albam. Albam? <laughs> doesn't I've, sound right, does it? It doesn't. It's probably Alban. us. Um, Albam. It, it, A-L-B-A-M. That's the brand to look out for. And they're the prices that you can sort of get um, for those items. Yeah. So yes, definitely one to add to our memory bank. Oh yes, it's so, in there. It's so thank you very much, yes, Andrew. Very you. kind of you. And we're going to move on to another one of Andrew's um, suggestions. And this is, it's an Andrew Fest this week, isn't yeah. it? This is Norse, Pro Norse Projects. Um, a con this is, they're based in Copenhagen. They're a contemporary Danish, Danish clothing brand. I haven't had enough coffee, hun. I can't get my words out I today. I'll have one in a minute. Oh, and was founded by three people with names I can't pronounce. Now this, hun, I didn't even write their names down. Because, oh, right, because you thought they had no chance in... Danish people, completely ridiculous for me to even try. <laughs> um, so they were people I can't pronounce as a retail streetwear shop and art gallery in 2004. The company launched its own line of menswear in 2009. So quite a new company. But 22 of their pre-owned items sold on the 11th of December, so quite good demand. 13 of those were for over £20, four of those were for over £40. So mm. quite strong prices yeah, for yeah. second-hand products. So we're going to start with a men's merino wool jumper in medium. Merino wool, as we've talked about before, any of the wools, lamb's wool, merino, alpaca, yeah. they mm. all go for quite good money. But this went on auction for £45 with £4.50 postage. Now, even this size small beige shirt, hun, managed to achieve £24.99 plus £5 postage on yeah. auction. So that's yeah. quite a good price for a small item. We've then got an, an Aros Slim Light Stretch Chino Trousers. This surprised me, hun. £49 plus £6.48 for some Chino Trousers. It's wow. good, isn't it? Yeah, it's good. So this is Norse Projects we're talking about, um, and the black corduroy jacket went for £54.95. Now we're going to finish up, Hunt, finish up. Oh, 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 we're we're going to go. Northern, Northern then. then. We're going to finish up. <laughs> it's because I know coffee's coming and I'm getting <laughs> excited. With a Martin Boiled Wool Shirt Cardigan. This went, Hun, on auction. It had 23 bids. Yeah. Crazy. Mm. Um, it went for £78.10p and with £4.45 postage. So I'll be looking out for that Martin Boiled Wool Shirt Cardigan. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> At that sort of price. So that sort of concludes our research. So that's Norse projects you're looking for there. Quite good um, prices. Yes, yeah. Again, very a bit good. of a manly day today, and mm. I suppose that must be what Andrew sells most of him. You know, specialises perhaps in the men's clothing. Yeah, the men's clothing. I mean, we haven't had a huge success with men's clothing, have we? No, but, but to um, be honest, we think we've you know we've bought we, we, mainly shirts, haven't we? And yeah, I think, I think it's it, it's been okay. Yeah, but I think you know we we, we, we I don't know we just we just haven't. Um, had an awful lot of success. No, we are not obviously getting the right items. Really, no, and I think because I'm the right brands. I'm a woman. I think perhaps I'm veering more to. Even though I started mm. off at men's, I think I'm veering towards the lovely dresses, dresses that I will never fit into. And I think it's because I like those because they're so pretty, aren't they? They um, are. They're lovely. And aren't? I think but the, the the problem with me is I can't. Uh, it takes me a little bit longer to retain the information than it does for you. So of course, when I'm looking for the for the men's, I I'm, I may have bypassed. So yeah, and to be honest, when we're um, in a charity shop, we are 
we're, we're like ninjas, aren't we? We're all whoosh. We are. We, we, go we do right go through. through. Maybe, maybe we do need to slow down a little bit. Yeah. Um, because we, we just want to fit in as much as we can in, in yeah, our Yeah, we're blanket day. bombing, aren't we? Blanket, we blanket bombing, bombing as many yeah. as we can get in. Yeah. Um, so perhaps that's something we need to... Um, need to address. Maybe yeah. just, just slow well, down Well, a good a old bit. chat over Christmas and a nice coffee. We'll we will. A good old planning. <laughs> see what, how we're going to go forward yeah yeah so thank you very much andrew collier it's very kind of you to help us and um it's given us some we've learned about now thanks to andrew three more clothing yes brands yeah no thank you very to look much out for. yeah definitely now we're going to just mention a couple of things as we um as we draw to a close we will this is our last um video i know i can hear you all cheering yes this is our last <laughs> video before christmas and we are taking a couple we're going to get loads break. of thumbs up on this one <laughs> yeah they're like, thank goodness <laughs> We are having a couple of weeks off from doing the clothing challenge yeah. because um, we won't be going out. It's, it's way too cold, huh? Way <laughs> yeah, too much just, going on with yeah. Christmas and family and everything. So our next video for the clothing challenge, we're back on the Friday, the 6th, 6th of, of January. January. 20, that that's the first time I've written 2023 23. down, huh? That's what we're aiming for. Yes. So we just want to take this time to thank everyone who supported us. There's mm. so many people. We can't mention you all, but... Um, yes, we're so grateful so, for so all, grateful. Your, um, all your support and a lot of you, um, you know, when we're a bit down sometimes in our videos, you, you send us very encouraging yeah. messages. So it's very kind of you. We are really chuffed, aren't we? Yes. And we're, we're yeah, just definitely. trying to do something nice for our daughter and it has been a challenge um, and it's been a lot of work, but we are really enjoying buying and learning all about new things yeah aren't they? i mean so, it's it's great you know we're widening our our widening our sort of knowledge base yeah sort that's of thing, it. and and that's the whole thing about it as well so you know we are we yeah, yeah. all right so we just want to thank you all for your support and we will we hope you have a really amazing christmas yes. and we will see you in the new year so thanks very much thank you Thank you for taking the time to watch our video and if you liked our content please like and subscribe to our channel subscription is free oh. you only got to press that little red subscribe button i've done it and, uh, and the bell icon oh and then you'll be notified for our future videos thanks for watching thank you